Hi, I'm Bobby Rio, and in this video, I want to give you a simple little mantra that will dramatically increase a woman's attraction towards you. In fact, it might be the most powerful mindset that you can ever instill. So I like to give simple advice when I can. Sure, I know that keeping a multitude of tips and techniques and you know tricks in your back pocket, it can certainly come in handy when you're out there and you're flirting with girls. But sometimes we just need that pillar, right? That pillar to gravitate to. A simple mantra that always helps us make the right moves. Whether you're meeting a new girl at the bar, chatting with a Tinder match, or you're out on that first date, always remember, here's the mantra, want, don't need. Catchy, right? See, need is bad. We learn that almost immediately when we start getting into, you know, studying game and dating advice. Neediness and desperation are the antithesis of attraction. Appearing desperate will turn almost any woman off. Whether you're texting too much, checking in too often, or exhibiting just a lack of confidence or insecurity or pleading for attention, we know you'll never get the girl when you do that, right? You should think of need in terms of that scratchy thing a cat does before it falls asleep on you, right? It's annoying and painful. Well, that's how a girl feels when you're acting needy. Want, on the other hand, is very powerful. Want is desire, and desire is the primary tool in sparking attraction in women. Of course, we want them to desire us, right? We, we know that, it's why we, you know, we try to be confident, we try to display value, we have you know, social graces, we do all that sort of stuff, right? It's why we dress and groom well, it's why we try to be funny, we try to strive for success. But here's something that guys almost always forget. Women want to be desired too. And I think that this is one of the top things that most guys overlook and they don't do. That's why uh, like shameless complimenting, establishing attraction with fantasies about dating or getting married and building sexual tension, that's why these things work. They all show the woman that you want her and she wants to be wanted. So you have to express desire for her without coming off like you need her. I get that sometimes that can be a little tricky line to walk, right? But here's the key, independence. Think of yourself like a train, the, the literal locomotive type, right? And girls are the passengers. Uh, of course you want them to ride the train, right? You sell tickets, you advertise, you make your cars as comfortable, as appealing as they possibly can be to get as many girls that wanna ride the train as possible. You're doing everything you can to make sure that your, your train is filled and that you, they know you want their business, right? But whether or not passengers show up on that train, that train is leaving the station. It has a destination and it waits for nobody. Have a destination in your life, one that does not rest on whether or not you have a passenger, right? If your main objective in life is to just get a girlfriend, I can't imagine any woman actually finding that attractive. Um, have your own goals and own your own ambitions. Any girl worth your time will surely get, she's gonna have her own, right? And in that way, you both act as passengers on each other's journey. Don't cramp her style. Want, don't, need. Now, if mindsets like this, they don't come naturally to you, then I suggest downloading my Player's Paradigm audio program, where I'll help you instill seven mindsets that all players share that make them so attractive to women. The program's only $9, and you can download it at the link below. As always, if you like this video, hit like, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe. And for the rest of the day, keep that mantra in your mind, want, don't need.